One of the particularly annoying things that can happen with a holly carburetor is a hot soak condition. This is when the car loads up at idle and then stalls because it's flooded. In order to restart the engine, you have to floor it, then crank it to get the excessive gasoline out of the engine, and then hold an elevated idle just to get the car home. After checking several things, I finally traced the problem to the primary accelerator pump. The lower gasket on the accelerator pump was leaking. That would allow gasoline to flow down the sides of the bores and enter the engine directly. And of course that would flood the car out at idle. On the bottom of the nozzle is a paper gasket. On a hot day after the car hasn't been driven for a while, this gasket will soak through with gasoline. This allows a small stream of gasoline to bypass the normal channels and nozzles and go straight into the engine, causing an overrich condition and the car floods out. The quick solution is just to replace the paper gasket with another paper gasket. Me, I was looking for something a little bit more permanent, so I went to the parts store and bought the same size O-ring, a quarter inch by three eighths by one sixteenth. When you're looking for an O-ring, make sure you get a nitrile, or as it's usually known, Buna N. This material is good for 250 degrees and will resist both gasoline and ethanol. Do not use EPDM as it will react with the gasoline and not give you good service. Just replace the lower paper gasket with the O-ring and make sure the O-ring is centered up before you tighten it up. And that should fix the issue with the hot soaking problems. And now if I blip the throttle, we see gasoline is flowing out into both Venturi. Well, time to put the choke back in and reinstall the carb. Take care. Have a great day.